welcome to Jones Nose Drones episode three. Today we're gonna to be looking at the DJI Inspire 1 with the Zen Moose X5 camera on it. It's a 20 megapixel camera. Uh, we use various lens. We use the 45 millimeter, 150 millimeter lens to get inspections so we can fly away from the structure. Uh, also by getting very close detailed pictures and not endangering the structure or the aircraft because we don't want to wreck any aircraft. Uh, anyway, so we're gonna be looking at this, taking off and uh, changing some lenses on it and uh, how to go back and forth from, from different lenses to do inspections and more cinematic stuff. So uh, let's take off. All right, so we've uh, landed on a regular flight with the Inspire 1. Now we're going to uh, put this Lumix 145 uh, 50 millimeter 145 uh, zoom lens on it. It is a manual zoom. DJI, DJI does not support uh, on the app to zoom. So it is manual zoom. That's a little little tricky, especially when you're flight with any high wind. But we're gonna go over how to, to switch lenses out and then we'll send up this and put it to something real close while we're flying really far. Alright, so we got this lens. It's uh, a Lumix lens. It's on the X5. You're gonna come in here and press the button. Let's change it out. Uh, what we had to do we had to come in and uh, shave some of this little red dot off here. This lens does require quite a bit of balancing. Um, you should get a red dot lined up. And in between, it should twist right on. Alright, so as you see, it's out of balance now. So we're working on getting the balancing up and then we'll show you how that works. Alright, so the weight, what I did is uh, I cut various things here, like uh, glued quarters together wrap them up but I'm using this um it's like a, a locking velcro here so I'm using that on the back of all these and I've got places on the camera uh, as you can see on the side here it's got velcro on it and uh I'm just gonna stick all these on all right so we've got all our weights on there and I'm gonna extend the lens and as you can see it uh Bounces out pretty well. So we'll go ahead and cut this on. I'll do take the lens cap off. That's a pretty good bounce, as you can see. This will allow us to get uh, pretty far back. This will allow us to get pretty far back from the structure and also get very close detailed pictures. So it works pretty well, just a manual focus. Alright, so thanks for tuning in to Jones Knows Drones episode 3. Just a quick run through of some stuff we use and the uh, birds we fly. Uh, we also fly Phantom 4 Pro and uh, as well as this one for inspections and we have two different lenses uh, to go on this as well. So uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed it. Tune back in. Everybody have a great day. Peace. Jones Knows Drones, yeah, Jones.